How's it going everybody? My name is Hazardous Daniel and welcome back to some more Kerbal Space Program 2. So we got a bit of an update this week from the development team regarding updates to this game. And according to them, they are planning to release an update tomorrow. Hopefully. Now they haven't mentioned exactly what this update's gonna have in store, but it is supposed to squash a couple bugs, including one that's very specific. The ability to create a Kraken Drive. So I figure we gotta start making a Kraken Drive like right now if I wanna make one, because uh, they're not gonna be in the game by Thursday. Hopefully. So I know that every Kraken drive in this game needs to start with one thing, and that is a rapier engine with something obstructing it. Now I think you can obstruct it with anything, but I'm going to obstruct it with a little RTG here because it seemed to give me the best results when I was testing. Gotta bring it out. Maybe there? Maybe... Is that is that far enough out? It's got to be like floating. Like this is the Kraken drive right here. So you're basically giving it backwards thrust and obstructing that backwards thrust and for some reason that makes forward go now it's actually interesting because the reason that this happens in the game is i don't know so we're gonna need to give it we're gonna go close cycle with this so let's give it two little tanks there and and let's give it a little end i want to i want to give it a, a nubbins end here this one oh that one will do oh yeah that's a change it around get the better paint job there that's a nice yeah yeah that's a plane I'll give it a docking port on the back just to cap everything off. And you know, if, if this does end up working, then uh, you know, you could use this to, to take up to your space stations and everything, uh, you know, until tomorrow, until tomorrow. So we're doing this plane style, even though I have seen there's a way to do it like, you know, rocket style, but I'm gonna do it plane style. I mean, you need to give it wings. Ooh, ooh, sweep the wings. Oh, that looks brilliant. Where's our center of mass? Oh no, that's bad. Uh, oh, actually, no, that's good. That's good, because I can give it... I want to give it some canards right here. Is that going to be good? I don't want it to interfere with anything, any of the operations we've got here. That looks nice. And hey, the center of thrust is really good. I need a stabilizer on the back here. Well, my goal is to keep this design very simple. Hey, that going to be good? That's nice. That's pretty good. Let's bring these wings forward a bit. That's pretty good overall. We, we got room for testing. That's all this is going to be is testing. Is this going to work for me? That seems like it'll work. Do I want to have a high like nose so we can get off the ground pretty quickly? I don't know how stable this thing is going to be. Let's test this. I want to make sure that everything works. Okay, save. This is going to be the Kraken 1. It goes where it goes. Why it goes. Nobody knows. Okay, so we've saved our craft. Who's going to fly this thing? We got to put Jebby in there. Jebediah, come here, buddy. 360 Delta V doesn't feel right, but I don't know. Let's test it out. How much DV do you need for a Kraken drive? I don't necessarily know. I do know you need to turn SAS off because it's going to cause some issues. Okay, we're here on the runway for our first test flight of the Kraken 1. Oh, and apparently we're already off. Okay. Oh, 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 okay, okay. Oh, hey. Oh, oh my God. Oh, oh, good Lord. Success? Paige, was that a successful flight? Okay. We learned something. I think we need to control thruster down. Let's do 5%. Let's go really slow. In fact, let's go slow in both regards here. So if I just go... Oh, it's going forward. Oh, it turns to Belisa stuff. Okay, so if I kind of throttle up now... Oh, that is so fast! That is, and it's up! And it's already up! And we're going! Oh my god, we're already up to... Oh my god, 200 meters per second. Wait, really? No kidding! Oh, and it's stable! Oh, bring the wheels up. It's, it's actually the... It's actually stable! Oh my god! Oh! It, it does lift up pretty fast, 500 meters per second. Oh my God, we're about to hit a thousand meters per second. Oh my God. Jeb, how are you doing? Oh, Jeb loves it. Jeb is loving it. Look at those eyes. He's terrified, but he loves it. Oh my God, okay. Can we crank the thrust limiter up a little bit? 11. Oh, it's, oh my God, it's almost up to orbital velocity. Look at it like, oh my God, look at it. Look at it like wiggle as I, ah, look at it wiggle. What a successful first flight. Oh, uh, Jeb, what, what's wrong, buddy? You're looking at, oh, Jeb, look at this. Jeb, whoa, Jeb. Slow down there, buddy. You're gonna get yourself sick. What if we try to go straight up? Does it have enough? I mean, it must, right? It's a Kraken drive. Yep, it could just go straight up. 
It's like burning a DV. Oh man, so if we gave it another, mm, wait, if we gave it another fuel tank. Oh, what's happened? Oh, I lost, I've lost some control of it. Oh no, I haven't. Have I? Oh, it's cause it's, are we in, we're in, we're supposed to be in, wait, hold on. Close cycle mode, yeah. We've kind of lost some control of it, I am noticing. Oh man, oh, but we're going like so fast. Good Lord. We get to the mud on this thing. So can I turn SAS on safely? Does it have enough? Yeah, it's tracking on. It is surely tracking on. So maybe if I gave it like a reaction wheel? We just took off from Kerbin in like under 150 meters per second. All right, if I haven't stopped moving now, it's just kind of lingering here. And I tell it to go forward. It, something fell off. Some, oh, one of the canards fell off. Oh, how about that? Oh, well now it's really unstable. Hey, what's going on? What's, uh, what's the, what's the dilemma here? Everything good? Everything okay? The camera's not following it anymore. Jeb? Jebby? Oh, Jeb is just floating off into space now. Okay, so what did we learn? We have learned that Daniel is really good at making Kraken drives. <laughs> so what if I give it some monopropellant? I, I've seen people use these to help stabilize things. So maybe a couple of them like right here. Is that gonna do well? That might interfere with the, uh, let's put them back here. I don't want it to interfere with the landing legs. Let's do another one back here. Another set of them. Is that good? Oh yeah, well, that's gonna be fine. Okay, so that might stabilize things. Let me, okay, I'm gonna extend it real quick. All right, pull that off, give it another tank. That should help give it some more Delta V. Bonk. 271, that's less. That's less DV. What do you mean it's less? Oh, these are methane engines. Oh, well, let's do this then. Let's replace these with a methalox engines then. One, two, but, all right, we're just gonna piece it back together now. Okay, everything's still good for a takeoff. And now we've got more Delta V, so it means that we can do more with this. Test number two, a little bit more stable this time. Okay, let's bring our thrust down to about 16, maybe less, like five. We are ready for our second takeoff. Boom, nothing's falling apart. How quickly can I just get off the ground? I still need a bit more. Okay, about 60 or 70 gets me off the ground. And now let's get up in the air and let's just punch it. Right? I mean, there's nothing wrong with just punching it, right? Whoa! Oh! Oh, oh my god, already up to 3,000 meters per second. Keep going, Jeb. Jeb, you got it. Jeb! Oh god, Jeb exploded! Oh no, Jeb's fine. Wait, wait, no, wait, Jeb's fine. He's just passed out. Oh, now he's dead. Well, that looked cool. But Jeb died. Okay, I have to admit, in the bug saga of this game, this has been one of the greatest things I've made. This is awesome. This is so good. So we can get up pretty high speeds, but we can't accelerate too fast or else Jeb here is gonna explode. So let's see if how fast we can get him up. All right, he's up, he's off the ground and he's accelerating. So we can accelerate a little bit faster than this. Let's keep him low to the ground though. I wanna keep him within Kerbin while we do this. It seems we have a lot more stability within Kerbin. Don't want it thrust him around too much. Let's go faster. Okay. This seems stable. This looks stable at least. We're basically clutching the horizon at this point. We're, we're rising a little bit. Okay. Okay. Jeb is still unaware of what's going on. He has, how does this work? It looks so ridiculous. Oh man, we're above the clouds. Okay. Let's try to, ooh, it's as it gets faster, it becomes so much like more jolty like that. Ooh, I don't want to break it. Okay, so can we go faster? Throttle up, 50% throttle, 3,000. We started breaking around 4,000, but I think it's because I had full power. All right, up a little bit, 55. Okay, we're losing, okay, okay, stability, stab hey, hey, shh, 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 Oh, okay, all right, we're back, we're back. We're back, let's go up a little bit. Let's see if we can go up and maybe it'll keep it more stable if we're going out of the air. Maybe it's, the I think it's the air friction that's really causing the issues. So the higher we are, 10,000, the faster we should be able to go, right? Yes. Throttle up. Higher, Jeb. Look at 5,000. 5,500. Before we break the atmosphere, come on. Let's get it up to 10. Jeb, you're making history. Jebby. Jebby, don't look so queasy. You're making history. Oh, God, Jeb. Don't throw up. Here we go. Oh, 10. We've done it. We're out. We're out. We're out. And... And we're out of the atmosphere. Okay, so RCS on, RCS on, RCS on, RCS on, RCS on, RCS on, stability assist on, and go to prograde. And look at that, the RCS is helping us stay stable. 
That's brilliant. All right, so just keep going. Whoa, whoa, hey, whoa. Okay, yes, yeah, so the second we're out of the atmosphere, stability is gone. We used 200 meters per second to get up there. We are at 11,000 meters per second in speed. And what's our trajectory? Out. Just out of Kerbin. We're gonna crash into the sun! Hey, sun round two, anyone? Anyone wanna go to the sun for round two? Take Jeb into the sun. Okay, third test. I wanna add more RCS so we can stay on target. One, two, pretty good. Should we do one up in the, near the front? Pretty good, pretty good. All right, so with our goal set to get out of the Kerbin system, we know what to do. Jeb, are you ready? Ready for round three, buddy? Launch. Going pretty fast already. We can already take off if we want to. Perfect. Execution. G. We need to break 10,000, but we don't want to break it too hard. Before we can start getting up all that speed, we got to get up, up at 10,000 and kind of flatten out is what I'm thinking. We're not taking off as fast, but we're going to take off pretty stable. Is this breaking any records? Am I a record breaker yet? This is great. This is so good. Get above 10. All right, we're above 2,000 meters per second and we're at 10. So let's flatten out now. And let's just crank up the throttle now. Speed go. Speed go fast. Speed go fast. Don't want to lose anything. That canard especially. That canard on the left doesn't like to stick around very long, does it? All right, we're, we have to kind of keep up with Kerbin's horizon if we want to stay within the atmosphere for as long as we do. There we go. There we go. All right. Oh, something stopped. Something stopped making a hissing noise. I don't know what that was. I guess that was... Is it the rapier engine? Okay, here we go. 10. All right, I'm going to, in a second here, cut the throttle. Stability assist on, RCS on, point to prograde. There we go. Okay, now, just keep going. Just keep it going. We have now broken out. It's staying on target. How fast can we go while well, it stays on target? Pretty fast, 1,200 meters per second. We should have broken. We have definitely broken Kerbin's sphere of influence. I want to take a look at the map screen, though. We're gonna hit the sun. I mean, that's what it's saying we're gonna hit. I think we're going, oh yeah, we're not gonna break. We're gonna end up hitting the sun and we're not gonna actually break Kerbin's SOI. Uh, well, let's just keep going. No shame in seeing what happens. Although, actually, you know what? It is, it is, since it's getting so tight, it's, it should launch us out eventually, right? Flippy flappy, flippy flappy. There you go, staying on target. Here it goes, here it goes. And it's out of here! It's out of here! <laughs> and there's Kerbin. And there's our ship. And we are out of here. Jeb! How does it feel? Jebediah, you are the first Kerbin to successfully use a Kraken drive to leave the solar system. <laughs> we have a current orbital velocity of 17,000 meters per second. What happens once we break Kerbin's SOI? What is that speed gonna do? Going down a little bit, but what happens once we break out of here? How fast does that speed have to be when it's out of here? Oh, it's less. It's less. Interesting. It's less. It's 13 right now. But now we're out of Kerbin's SOI, and we're out. We're going to leave the sun's SOI. So I guess... Oh, 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 look. Look at the canard. It's stuck around, but it's just kind of there now. Oh. Oh, it's like... Oh, so weird. It's still attached to the ship. But not... Oh, man, that's bizarre. Does it accelerate with us? Hold on. Is that what the issue was? It doesn't accelerate with us? It doesn't accelerate with us. That's what the issue is. Bye. I feel like to end this, we just gotta... We just gotta launch it one more time real fast. Let's build up the speed, though. All right, everyone. Just take straight off. Go, Jeb. Go straight up. Straight up, Jeb. There goes a man with a plan. <laughs> All right, everybody. Thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to like and subscribe if you enjoyed. And also leave a comment down below. Tell me what you want to see next. But as always, my name is Daniel. And Jeb and I will see you next time. <laughs> my God, he's already up to 6,000. What's happening? Wait, where's he going? Wait, what's happening? He's flipped. He's flipped. Jeb. Oh, God, he's spinning out of control. Jeb, you good? Jeb? Oh, God, I don't think he's good. I don't think he's doing well at all. All right, buddy.